Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Lost Heads TV, we are Ray and MC. And I'm Ray. I'm James. If you're new to the channel, welcome. We do a lot of things here. Mainly, it's a music and horror based channel. One thing that I specifically like to do, James as well, is review fan films. Because mm -hmm. I feel like fan films don't get enough love. They don't. So, yesterday I was watching this one. This one is called Saw and Toxify. Disclaimer I've seen this. James is not. It's only six minutes long. It's not long at all. But I just really liked how this is shot. It's one of the better Saw fan films I've seen. And if you think about it, it's kind of hard to do a Saw fan film. Yeah. It's not like you're like slasher. You, know? mm -hmm. you, you can make, you can mold things around that. Yeah, this it's is very hard to do so, yeah. Yeah. But I really enjoyed it. So I'm going to get James' take on it, see if he enjoyed it. Maybe he'll like it. Maybe he won't. But we'll discuss that at the end. Discuss with you guys. All right, let's roll it. I just love the fucking cinematics right there, bro. That was dope. Got <coughs> a fucking light bulb in your mouth, bro. That's not an LED either. That's a hot bitch. <laughs> Someone I can call? Can help you get home safe? You're the one who's gotta get home safe. Damn. Piss off, bro. You've forgotten your vows to your wife. Dismissing the sacred symbol of a love eternal as just another pocket trinket. <laughs> Besides, always seeing what others have, never appreciating the bounty of what's been given to you. Excuse me, can you keep an eye on my things for me for a minute? Yeah, I got you. Thanks, man. Should have known better. And drank his beer. Make a move, bro. Yeah, I gotta do something.
Was actually pretty nice. Yeah. Well, like, the little bit of what they had, I didn't expect him to live though. Good. But I think that would have probably played more factor if it was at the if the time limit was like running. I guess. Was there two things I caught the second time around? I didn't catch the first time. Like two of the three flashback scenes, I don't remember. I guess I was multitasking at the time. But yeah, dude, I loved the way it was edited. Like especially like when he was in the trap about to do his shit. The editing was so saw esque. Yeah, it was. Love that. Like, and the fucking like, finger peeling off mm, and shit. That's brutal. I like the story too. Like he's an alcoholic. You know, he's hurt a lot of people. What does John Kramer do? He uses those staples of your wrongdoings and he flips it on you. This dude had fucking bourbon going through his veins and he would have died of fucking alcohol poisoning. Yeah. Like I I just loved every bit of it. I really did. I thought it was dope. I just, I didn't know where they were going with the fucking light bulb at first. You know what I mean? Like him buying on the light bulb. Like, all right, how's that, how's that gonna play in this? But I did think it was interesting. At least like for the little bit of time they had. And they had to go crazy and do like a bunch of gore shit or whatever. Mm -hmm. They had that one scene with the, th the finger and that's as far as they had to go with it. That was nice. It was real nice. Satire Brewing Company. Hell of a job, man. Props to you. Good job, y'all. Like I said, I've watched a lot of fan films, some soft fan films as well. This is definitely one of the better ones I've seen. I like their original score as well. Like I said, I, I've never seen a soft fan film before that. Oh, you have No one. I've seen, well, I watch fan films all the time. It's one of the better ones I've seen. I figured you'd like it. I did. I thought it was nice. Yeah, every aspect of it was like really good. Cinematic story, the trap. It was simple. You know what I mean? Simple. Like that. It was, you had to go crazy and do all this extra shit. It was simple. The only thing I didn't particularly, not dislike, it was hard to hear Kramer was talking or whatever. Yeah, it was kind of like, I had to really pay attention. Yeah, you had to really pay attention. But other than that, it was still really good. So I have no complaints for real. Let us know what y'all thought about it. Tell us if you've seen other Saw fan films. Which one do you like? Do you want us to check out some more? Gladly get into it. Until next time, y'all. This Adios. Let me tell you how it's about to go. Let me show you the towel you're about to throw. This is hip hop, try to run in our house, we'll knock your ass straight out the door. I'm the enemy's epitome, the fantasy, my tendency to mentally give your career to that penalty. I instantly advise you to match my intensity, try to fit my brain like Jackie Kennedy. I so tired of the why not side of putting MCs in a pine box. You motherfuckers couldn't even hit me in my blind.